Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be discussing another functional equation that can be solved using the substitution strategy. But this time, instead of substituting with small numbers, we'll be substituting with expressions of x. For example, we'll be substituting with minus x, 1 plus x, and similar expressions in order to be able to solve the problem. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started. So here we're asked to find all the functions f from r to r such that the following relation holds. x plus 1 times f of x plus x times f of 1 minus x equals 2 times x. So if we look at the problem, we can see that we have f of x is linked to f of 1 minus x. So if we know the value of f of 1 minus x, then we can conclude the value of f of x using this equation. So simply the idea is, since we have x is linked to 1 minus x, so in order to know the value of f of x, we need to know the value of f of 1 minus x. So simply, let's substitute x with 1 minus x in order to know the value of 1 minus x. So simply, substitute x with 1 minus x. Let's find out. So now we have 2 minus x times f of 1 minus x plus 1 minus x times 1 minus 1 minus x is actually x. So now we have f of x equals 2 times 1 minus x. So basically, now we have f is linked to f of 1 minus x, and we have also f of 1 minus x is linked to f of x. So now we have a system of linear equations. So we can simply solve these two equations uh, using the way that we prefer, and then conclude the value of f of x. OK, so now let's find out the value of f of x uh, by solving these two equations. So what, we're, what I will be doing is summing up these two equations. So let's sum these up. Now here we have minus 2x plus 2x gets cancelled, so we have 2. Two equals, here we have x plus 1 times f of x, here we have 1 minus x times f of x, so the sum is 2 times f of x. And here we have x plus 2 minus x, which is also 2. So here we have f of 1 minus x, which means that we have f of 1 minus x plus f of x equals 1. OK, so and that's a nice equation. So we can substitute f of 1 minus x with 1 minus f of x in the first equation. So now we have x plus 1 times f of x plus x times 1 minus f of x equals 2 times x. You can see that here we have x times f of x and here we have minus x times f of x. So those get cancelled. So now simply we have f of x plus x equals 2 times x, which means that f of x equals x, which is what we want. So we have found the func our function f, f of x equals x. So let's check whether it satisfies the functional equation. So here we have x plus 1 times x, which is uh, x squared plus x, and here we have x times 1 minus x, which is minus x squared plus x, and their sum is indeed 2 times x. So indeed, our function f is a solution for the functional equation, and so we're done. So the idea of this problem is that when you have x linked to another expression of x, always try substituting with this expression of x, 
and keep substituting until you arrive to x. So here we were lucky that we substitute x with 1 minus x and then immediately we reached x. But sometimes we don't get that lucky, so sometimes we need to do one substitution and then another one and a third one until we reach x. But usually when we reach x, then the problem is solved. In the next couple of lessons, we'll be discussing another similar functional equations that can be solved using the same strategy, but with more complex substitutions. So like, share and subscribe and see you guys in the next lesson.